Let's bring you right to the story of downtown Boston, what would normally be approaching lunchtime when uh, thousands of people would be walking through Copley Square. David Robichaux is there as he has been since early, early this morning. Roby? He's it. Yeah, it's a, little er it's a little eerie now, but it was much eerier early this morning, like 5 o'clock in the morning, where there wasn't supposed to be anybody out except for essential employees. Let me show you some video of an essential employee, okay? This is Tammy Casey. She lives on the North Shore. She works at Tufts Medical Center as a nurse. Now, Tufts had booked all the hotel rooms they could. They were full up. So she decided to come down from the North Shore, stay with a friend, but she had to walk two miles to Tufts today in order to get to her patients. And here's what she said to us. All the hotel rooms were filled by Tufts last night, so I stayed at a friend's house but knew I'd have to walk in this morning. How far do you have to walk to work this morning? Uh, maybe a couple of miles. A couple of miles. You're like, yeah, no big deal. Well, no, it's, you, you do what you can and plan ahead. I work in the holding room area, so I get people ready for surgery. I put their IVs in and get all their information before they go into the operating room. Will they do surgeries today? Yes, we had a, a few book surgeries that couldn't wait. I tweeted that out this morning and Tufts uh, tweeted me back. They also said we have such dedicated personnel here at Tufts Medical Center and we're proud of all of them. That's the latest from Copley Square. I'm David Robichaux. Jonathan, Paula, back to you. Roby, you know exactly where this yeah. is going because in 30 or 40 years from now, she's going to look at her grandkids and say, stop complaining. When I was your age, I walked two miles through a <laughs> snowstorm to save lives. Through a blizzard. And she'll kind of sound like surgery. <laughs> All right, Roby. Oh, uh, Roby, great story. Hats off to Tammy Casey. Yeah. What a great nurse.